Text animations are what take your edits from basic to advanced. Here is everything you need to know about 2D text animations in After Effects. Press Ctrl T to activate the text tool and click in the composition to create a text layer. When you open the text options and press the animate button, there are many options. All text animations have to have a property, the parameter that you are animating, and a selector, which has many rules for how to animate the chosen property. All these properties essentially function the same way, so let's use position as an example. When you press a property to animate, an Animator 1 tab should appear with the defaulted Range selector inside, as well as the property chosen as a parameter. However, this position parameter is different from the position parameter in the Transform options. This new position parameter is actually an offset to the original position parameter. The Range Selector 1 is how you blend between the offset version of the text and the original version of the text. This is where you keyframe the offset value to go between the start and end position values. The Advanced tab under the Range Selector allows for further details to be added. You can select whether you want characters or words to be affected at a time. You also pick a shape you want your animation to take. These text animations you've seen everywhere are made using this exact technique. If you want to learn how to use expressions to make even more dynamic animations, click this video. Subscribe.